What's cracking, y'all? You are now watching Boo TV. Appreciate you for stopping in. Like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell, stay notified, and let's get into the topic for today. What's cracking? What's cracking? What's cracking? How's everybody doing? Back with another one from the Nico Gallis playlist. Uh, I guess you could say the Michael Jordan playlist too. But um, so legend has it that. In 1983, Nico Gallus or Nick Gallus and Michael Jordan squared off in an exhibition game. Um, the Greek national team versus the uh, Tar Heels, UNC, and Mike. And then some people say in that game where the Tar Heels won, I think 100 to 83, that Nick dropped 50 points on Mike. And Mike had 34, and then I'm also hearing that Gallus dropped 24 points and Jordan scored 34. So either way, whether he scored 50, whether he scored 24, the dude balled out. And Jordan said himself, not verbatim, that Nick Gallus is one hell of a basketball player. And I think he said that he's better than he even thought he was, if I'm not mistaken. For those of you that don't know, Nick Gallus is a legendary former Greek basketball player who was supposed to go to the NBA but never actually played. He was supposed to play for the Boston Celtics, if I'm not mistaken. Don't quote me on that. It's been a little bit since I read up on him. Um, but I, I, I think... I think it, there was something about him and the Celtics, if I'm not mistaken. But the dude was a fantastic basketball player, could do a whole bunch of different things on the floor. But I'm not going to get into that now. I have a Nick Gallus playlist. Go check out the Nick Gallus playlist. I already have, excuse me, I already have two other videos uh, about Nick where you can get all the information about him if you want to get it from this channel and me learning about it, doing some research and talking about it. All right. Shout out to Creontis who put me on the path of Nick Gallus. And here we are again, dipping in to some content. All right. Let's check out some highlights from his uh, duel with Michael Jordan. Let's get into it. Dude had a nasty floater. Classic Jordan move right there. Ooh. Ooh. Bro, he shook Jordan out of shoes. Rewind. Dude, he shook Jordan and then finished with the nasty pass. Watch this. Ooh. Wow. Thank you. 
Jordan. Looks like Greece is playing a 3 2 zone defense. A 180 action. Ah, I wish we had more footage of that game. I wish we had more footage. That was cool. It's cool seeing exhibition games like that. Uh, and I was noticing how Greek or Greek, how the Greece team was. Um, I was watching their defense on. UNC passing the ball, and they were all shifting in unison how you're supposed to play in a zone defense, not guarding the player, you're guarding the ball, where the ball's going, movement of the ball, shifting. And they had that 3-2 set up with hands up, shifting. It was it was in unison. It was beautiful. It's beautiful to see. Uh, I didn't catch it. I don't know if they were playing that zone the entire game because maybe I wasn't paying attention, but at that one point, I was paying attention to it, and I saw it for that one play. But, um, hey, man. Gallus and Jordan going at it in that small sample size of highlights that we've seen, but still nonetheless beautiful to see. Jordan, 1983 UNC, was showing us shades of what he would become with the Chicago Bulls, and Nick Gallus was just doing Nick Gallus things, man. He shook Jordan out of shoes. Jordan was like, I ain't saying he was stumbling, but he had him going the other way, and he had to recover himself. And then he came out with like this no-look pass back out to the, to the wing or just inside. It was uh, beautiful. Greek style, baby. Gallus style, baby. Listen, listen. Giannis Antetokounmpo, my current favorite player in the NBA. It's a shame I don't do more Giannis content, being that he's currently my favorite player in the NBA. And I rarely talk about him or do any Giannis content. There's just so much stuff I got to talk about, I want to talk about. It's a shame. Um, but, um, hey, before Giannis, it could have been Nick Gallus as far as the, the premier Historic, uh, historically the premier Greek guy in the NBA. Could have been Gallus, man. If him and Bird would have teamed up, my lord. Whew. And if they if they were able to get him and still put together the core of the team that we known known uh, the Boston Celtics to be historically in the 80s, especially that all-time great team. Whew. Kidding me? Mm. Hi, more another high, high, uh, highly intelligent basketball player added to the Boston Celtics lineup. They they had a knack for building uh, a roster of you know high basketball IQ talent, no question. Yep, go check out our Nick Gallus playlist, please. If you want to see me talk more about this player, and if you got more Nick Gallus content from me that you want me to check out, let me know, and I'll do my best to check it out. All right, appreciate you guys. Thanks for stopping in. Like, comment, subscribe, hit that damn bell, stay notified, and I'll catch you on the next one. We out, baby.